SMS marketing in 2023 is exploding. Businesses are dumping lots of R&D behind and creating engaging experiences for their clients. In this short video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to create a SMS chatbot using ManyChat. This is a powerful capability of the ManyChat platform that you wanna jump in on. Let's take a look at some of the stats. In 2023, the size of this market is expected to grow $12.6 billion, and businesses are dumping over $339 billion into this investment on SMS. It's no surprise, with open rates at 98%, response rates of 45%, and the fact that 91% of customers want to receive text messages from their business. So if you're a realtor out there, it's not just about using CRM to set up drip and a drip campaign with email and text messages. What we want to do is create an engaging experience that works 24 seven for you. So while you're sleeping, somebody texts your business, the bot can automatically respond and have an engaging conversation over messenger uh, or SMS in this case, so that you know you have an engaging client to deliver a lead to your doorstep when you wake up. So what I wanna do is I wanna jump into ManyChat and let me show you exactly how this works. So let's hop over. So in ManyChat, if I come down to settings, SMS is one of the channels that we have in the uh, ManyChat platform. A video that I had on my channel uh, not that long ago, I showed exactly how to set up a Twilio phone number inside of ManyChat to connect your phone number to the chatbot. That's step number one. You wanna have the channel open and ready to go. And at the very top, you wanna to have it enabled. And then what you do is you come over here to automations, and this is where you can create a new flow. And in the flow, you could start with just an SMS right here and send them a text message so when they come in. But what I'm gonna do just to uh, show you how I've done it myself is I'm gonna jump in and show you some of the best practices I have in creating that chatbot experience on SMS. So this is a flow that I created for one of my clients. So if I go to the starting step, the way that we've set this up for them is we are looking for keywords. So if some one of their clients texts the word help, credit, debt, hello, hi, okay, uh, they have a number of keywords that they look for in their business. When somebody texts a, a, a response back to their phone number, that's when the chatbot kicks in and starts the conversation. Now, what we come in is this particular client wanted a multilingual, a multilingual uh, chatbot. So my chatbot, the ProEdge chatbot that I always promote here on the channel, uh, speaks uh, fluent English and Spanish. So I carried that over to this project for this client. Uh, now, in, in chatbot marketing on SMS, uh, you don't have the luxury like we have on Messenger and Instagram where we have buttons that they could select. So you got to use innovation. So like enter one for Spanish and two for uh, English. So what I do in the first step is when they message me on their, uh, on their phone uh, through the, the phone number, uh, I'm gonna ask them that question right away and then they respond by typing one or two in the response back. And then what we do is we use conditions. So if the SMS is, or uh, language is one, uh, go in here uh, uh, down this path and if it's two, go down this path. So basically what I'm doing is I'm, um, I'm setting them to Spanish if they type one and then English for anything else. Now what's also really important, and let me edit this flow for a second, ManyChat gives us the ability, if I look at this first message, is you wanna use what's called a user input uh, field. And that's what I did here, this is a user input. So this user input, let me get rid of that guy, um, I'm storing the value in a SMS language uh, field. So that way I can evaluate it in that condition that you just saw. So you don't want to just send a text message back. You want to do a, a, a message that's in a container, which is called a user input. So whatever they type back, ManyChat will capture what they type. And then I can now use that downstream to decide where I want to take them. And that's exactly what I'm doing here. I'm checking that SMS language field. If there's a one in it, go to Spanish. So that's the real importance. So then you can have all kinds of fun in chatbot marketing. You'll notice that these are all uh, up here. It's an SMS message that comes back. Uh, we can do images. We can do all kinds of tagging. Uh, and we can go through and ask them all kinds of questions. So what I'd like to do now is just show you this in action. So uh, let me see how this works in the real world. So here's my phone. So if I come in the phone, uh, somebody uh, texts that phone number, uh, uh, the message, you'll see there's the language and I said one. And then as I come in here, 
I'm starting to ask them questions. Would they like to talk to somebody or stay here? And then it gives them an introduction. And I have this on fast forward just to save time here on the video. But there's that image. And now you're seeing I'm having different questions. And they answer one, two, or three. And then down here, a little bit of detail. And I'm asking them for a phone number, um, or I mean an email. And in this case, it said, please uh, enter a correct email. So over here, we have uh, the email. And then are they late on their payments? And it's going through an interactive experience through the chatbot, all through chatbot marketing here on ManyChat. So in 2023, get on the bandwagon, get your SMS chatbot marketing going and watch your business thrive. And this is just one of the many channels that I promote here on the, uh, the ProEdge Marketing channel. On ManyChat, I have Instagram bots, uh, WhatsApp bots, I have Messenger bots, and now SMS bots. There's also Telegram, and stay tuned. There's rumors that new channels are coming with uh, ManyChat shortly as they release different channels each and every year. So I can't wait to see what the next set of channels are in the ManyChat platform. I hope you like this video. If you haven't already, smash that like button, give me some comments, and if you haven't subscribed, I'd love to have you here on the channel. Enjoy.